What is going on, Lofi boys? We're back. We're back in Mountain Blade. The last episode. Oh man, what did we do? We found Luson. We definitely found him. Uh, you talked to Luson. I got some valuable information to help you understand the artifact. That we did. He's in a bit of a tight. He's in a bit of a battle right now. So good luck to Luson. But. We do need to talk to a few more people. So we're going to go explore. I'm definitely not getting too involved in what's happening over there. But I did talk to one of the lords just before. I'm going to talk to this guy. He looks like he's going to go join the battle. Oh, come here, dude. Hello, I am Luffy. I am... These guys have some crazy names. Hur... Hurunag of the Tigrit. I'm sure you've heard of the name of our clan of the Epic. Epics of the Steppe, Steep, whatever. We carry the name of one of your ten... Okay, whatever, man. Can you tell me anything more about the battle? I was there, many of the careers went, mostly the careers clan, we were hungry for glory, but I was also young and hungry for glory, so I went along well. Sure you did. While Naret's vanguard was getting slaughtered, we met the Valanian, but the Valanians brought lots of crossbowmen and their horse archers took heavy losses. Eventually, the armored imperial cataphracts showed up and rolled over the crossbows, but we were caught in a melee with the Valandian knights. And that was where things got bloody. I'm sure they did. We won barely. With the help of the Imperials. But the Kyrix were mauled. Since the Kyrix... Damn, this is loud. The Kyrix have been rather weak. And you know what happened to the weak? What happens to the weak? Yeah, we do, don't we? Still, no one told them to put all their eggs in one basket like that. Sure. Thanks, man. Much appreciated. Look at this guy with the... F Whoa. Did you guys see that? That guy's... Nice. Okay, we need to talk to a few more. We'll just They're just coming to us, so we'll just intercept them. Jaghan. Chungus. <laughs> Peace to you, stranger. What is your name? I am Luffy. Our clan is loyal, so the carrier. Yeah, I'm sure you have. I wasn't there. I know Monchug. That's a cool name. Has some thoughts about it. Okay, so yeah. I need to find this Monchug dude. Man, all these armies are going over to Luson. Luson is getting wrecked today. pretty sure this I did set out I did have a little explore just before and I'm pretty sure this guy could oh stop damn he's got a he's got a beast of an army I bid you peace at least until I find another way you are anyways that's good man yep yeah. okay Monchug I think he could be over here somewhere. Let's go for a little, little explore. Oh, hello, looters. Oh, yes. You better run. Okay. Where is Monchug? Man, these guys are hard to find. Monchug. And Curion of the Northern Empire has been taken prisoner by Monchug of the Curion September. Okay, last seen near 
Okay. He's over there. Where is that? Leave. Damn it. Okay, we don't need to track these places anymore. Let us... Let's go. It is very pretty. Oh! Oh, there's a hideout. Don't think we want to take that on. Is he inside? Where are you, Monchog? Why don't we recruit some troops, maybe? Do we want some Kazits? Nah. We're going to stick with 19 for the moment. We're going to... Mm, we probably need a little bit more food, man. We're going to... We're going to starve soon. Crap, we're running out of cash. Ah, uh, boy. We need to take on some guys soon. Okay. We need to find Monchug. Damn, this guy's on a mission right now. Where is he? Oh, he's gone. We we missed him. Okay. This guy better not be south. I swear to God. Okay. Monchog. <gasps> Monchog. No. Yes. We found Monchug. Oh, what a man. Your, yours is not a face I know. What is your name, stranger? I'm Lofi. I'm Monchug. Yeah, we've been trying to find you for like two days now, man. I don't know your name. But no matter. Some say there is a greater honor to be found in the greater lineage than to be born with one. Yes, the Emperor of, Ner the Emperor of Neritz had offered to hire our warriors as mercenaries. I saw nothing wrong with that. The Empire was an old bear. Right. Well fed, slow moving. It wanted to keep it what it had. The Sturgeons were and are hungry wolves like us. Sometimes wolves hunt in packs and sometimes they don't. Sometimes one wolf wants the lion to kill its rival. Okay. Most of those who went were Kuriks. They are young they are a young clan. Their lineage is not like ours. They were always looking to prove themselves. Anyway, at the battle, their Noyan, Goturg, was slain alongside most of the males of his house. What can I, what can I say? A, first, a thirst for glory is dangerous, both to the thirsty one and those around him. Clans rise, clans fall. My duty is to all the curse. Look at this way. We... Were it sorry, <laughs> it's a lot of reading. Were it not for the husband's death, Lady Masu would never have inherited the leadership of the Kericks. Death creates opportunity. The survivors of a great battle make a great show of mourning, but inside they rejoice. Thank you. Finally, goodbye, Monchug. I hope I come across you again and kill you yeah he met Lofi <laughs> that's so funny okay we're getting there gonna 
looking at? What are these guys doing? I need to kill. I need to take on someone and sell some stuff soon. I'm Luffy. I was there. Now I gotta find this chick. Where is that? Oh my lord. I need to kill something soon. <gasps> yes. You're stuck now. <laughs> the spot. The spot works. I'm so happy. Here we go. Oh, look at this. Okay. Archers! Move! Okay. Move! Yeah. Move! That's good. Arrows! Okay. Attack! Everyone just charge in. What are you boys doing? Oh my lord! My archers are getting slaughtered. Oh! sucks like that was painful I have to get used I have to get used to the freaking keys man that really sucked oh well you live and you learn I guess she's still like mid fight there she is Look, I know you're busy. You're having a bit of a... You're battling right now. So I'm just gonna... Just interrupt you. Can you go and talk to them, please? Hmm. She's busy. So... Let's see if these looters want to get involved. Come on, bro. I don't want to go too far away. Because I'm, I'm going to have to talk to them eventually. Oh. Hey, Rag. That's great. Of course, I did not witness better, but my husband spoke frequently of it. I'm sure he did. He was one of the Emperor's trusted comrades. He could not stop Nerys from marching to defeat, but he managed to salvage something from the disaster. When the Sturgeons came over a barricade, he managed to lead a group of Nerys guards, guardsmen out the, out the back. My husband's small force held together and were joined by strugglers of fugitives. He described the march back. No food, little water, marching day and night. Sorry, to keep ahead of the enemy's outriders, but they survived, the only organized Imperial force to do so. The city was in a state of panic after hearing rumors of what happened. Arenikos kept things from descending into chaos. When it came time for the Senate to choose the next emperor, there was no question that would be him. I loved him before as a man, 
but that that day learned to love him as something more. What a gift he was to the people of Calderia. Sure he was. Thank you. She's got quite the army there. Let's go talk to this guy, if we can catch him. I'm Luffy. Who do I have to find now? Okay. Sure. Last scene. Uh, last scene is Zuko. Okay, where is that? This quest really just, uh, it takes you all over. See, look, now I have to go all the way over there. Oh, it's just there. But we're going to finish this quest. Yes, we are. We're going to finish it. No. Yes. Bad decision? Sure. Okay. Infantry! Okay, so we've just got one group. Forward! We have zero archers again. Because they all died in the last battle. So that's a real bummer. Alright boys, screw it, we're going in. Holy crap. Just chop him from behind. You're not going anywhere. Oh, got him in the leg. Blind shot. Nice. Okay, we lost three. That's okay. We're going to get a plenty of goodies from this. Oh man, we got some grain as well, some cheese, oil, spiked mace. God damn. Pilgrim's hood. I really want to change up my gear, but right now I'm like just just got the same stuff. I guess I can put some arm wraps on, eh? Pad of garments, cloak. Very cool. City. Sure. We got some wounded in that battle, but that's okay. Our quest continues. Please stop. Guess he's just checking the cities. No, don't go in. Ugh. Oh, he's in there. Yeah, I want to talk to this guy. Oh, there he is. Yes, we'll never forget that day, the day we learned that the old men who claimed that they, they had the right to rule us were doddering incompetence. I was with the vanguard, Naritz. Naritz apparently knew that the Batanians had planned an ambush the quits. Kuzates scouts had told him but never bothering to form us so up we went along a lovely wooden stream until the battalion arena okay we had our shields but you can only point them in one direction at once so we started to drop one by one until the battalion flex falksmen came screaming out of the trees ordinarily they would be very Vulnerable to archers, but well, old Noretz hadn't thought to send any along with us. 
So they came up chopping and slashing and we fought until we broke. I ran too. And any man who tells you he wouldn't in those circumstances was a liar. When I was sitting in the cold woods later that night, hiding with the other fugitives, listened to the barbarians whoop the holler and chopped off heads as trophies. I promised them that no Caldarian soldiers should be led into battle with an emperor who knows so little about war. Yeah, that's true. Man, it must be an absolute, like, I know this is just a game, but it would have been absolutely brutal back then. We're doing really savage. Like, we're pretty, we're, we're pretty lucky to be living in the time that we are now. Okay. Quest is updated. Man, we're getting there. This is a long-ass quest, I tell you that. Yeah, all of you join in. I don't care. You'll never take us alive. Well, that's your problem then, isn't it? boys it's gonna be nice when I actually have hearts that hit something gee you guys aren't even facing them Face, dude. No. Yes. All of them dead for once. That's okay. That's okay. Get some more goodies. That's what I'm talking about. Let's go inside, sell a few more things, sickle, olives, we'll keep the olives, doing pretty well now, we'll chat to this guy, see if he can give us a Okay, the next person. Oh man, if you make me go travel. Where is it? It's probably something stupid. Is that where it was that where he said sorry? Yeah. I thought so. Man, <laughs> it's just back and forth. Oh. Okay, so I think I'm really hoping that this is the guy. And quit, stop this stranger. I bid you peace. At least until I find out who you are anyway. I'm Lofi. I'm Euclid, Sultan of Asura. Thank you. It was a tragedy that gnawed at the roots of the great families of Caldaria, even hours so far away from battle. We heard that the Empire was making war on the Sturgeons, or maybe it was the other way around. I thought that we had no stake in this quarrel, but Nim... Nim... Nimmer, a fiery young hero from... the from the Bani Saran asked me for permission to take some young warriors eager for glory. The Empire had left us alone for a while and Naretz was offering silver for men so I thought why not let them use it. Let them help the Empire. Ah, oh, I should have known the best of course was wars. There's a little to do with them as you possibly can. That's pretty true. So Namir, 
went and fought and won Gloria, but also got a number of men killed, especially those for the Bani, Bani killed. Man, these names. And then became boastful and arrogant. And then, well, that is the beginning of the great feud between the Sarins, Sarinis, and the Quildus. But the rest of the story I should have probably leave it somewhere else. Well, thank you. Man. Gotta get a party, Renan. We're getting close. Our Renan is getting up there. Party size. We need to get our party size up. Oh, I need to hire one companion. Six! May I talk to you for a quick sec? I wasn't there, I know Olek. Alright, oh man, we gotta go all the way north by the looks of it. Olek, Olek. Where is Olek? Oh, of course he is. Oh my goodness. That was a long way to go. But we'll go. Oh, look! There's Olek. Don't go inside. Yes. Alright. We found him. Tell me your name, forgive me if I've not met you before, and I do remember the occasion. occasion. For I have seen many warriors come to this land and pass swiftly into the shallow graves. Oh, I'm sure. I'm Olek. La la la. Can you tell me a bit more? A victory won by my father. Oh, wow. Claimed by Ragnvad. Old King Vanislav was brave enough to lead us into the battle. I stood on my father's side as we faced the Imperials eye to eye. Over the tops of our shield, it was like any battle where shield walls met. Thrust and push, struggling to stay on your feet, but you can't really describe it. Let's just say it's a kind of battle that Sturgeons usually win. When the Imperials have had enough of us, they broke and ran for the ramparts. There they threw darts and rocks and they cursed fire. We had to go up the ladders one by one. Ladders I was hit in the, by a mace oh, and went down. My father then went up, cleaving as he went and then rallied us to lead us to victory. My father took the Imperial Dragon Banner from the dead, the Red's hand. It was a famous story. And but then, the little prince, Ragnvad, tried to claim it. My father broke it over his knee, threw it at him, oh jeez, and told him to get his own toys to play with. <laughs> Brutal. That's it, man. Very good. Thank you very much. I'm gonna go inside. I'm gonna trade, get some of this, some of this, probably wouldn't hurt getting a bit more grain, oh, we're definitely getting some cash now, recruit some troops, new one, Talk to this guy. See if he can lead us to the next guy. Ooh, we're getting to it now. Wow. Okay. Well, we intercepted someone. Go done. Hey. I don't think I know you. Peace to you, stranger. Can you tell me? Yes, it was madness. The greatest blow struck against the Empire in a lifetime, and we squandered his squabbling among ourselves about a flag. They say Olek the Old had pried the Dragon Banner out of the Emperor's dead hands, but then Prince Ragnvad, who had not much 
who had not so much as drawn his sword in the battle, claimed it as a trophy. Oleg was then covered in his enemy's blood, laughed Ragavad, and told him to go find his own toy. We did we did know that from the last guy to play with. Ragavan struck him, so Oleg broke the banner staff over his knee. Yes, we were told this. Or perhaps it was just Ragavad. He was stewing in his anger when it comes to the Batinian, Batinian king, Caladog. The Batinians had taken their time stripping the bodies of the Imperial Vanguard, and the Sturgeons were angry at them. So Ragavan called him a coward. Caladog sneers at him and walks off. Insults his most powerful vassal and then insults his most valued ally. A fine day's work, wouldn't you say? But he has grown wiser since, though. No more peasants to spend time with. Thank you. Oh my goodness, we're so close to the finish of this quest. One more guy. Ragnvad. Okay. So we're here at the castle. We got Ragnvad running away. He hasn't got he hasn't got too far to go though. Let's go intercept him, have a chat, and that should be the quest finally completed. Man, he's got some cool armor though. I am Lofi. I am Ragnvad, King of the Sturgeons. Ooh, he is the king. One thing you should know, if you cross me, if you cross me, you'll regret it. Can you tell me about the battle? Yes. The day that my father died thanks to Batinian treachery. When they pledged to support us in the battle, we believed they would not stand with us in the shield wall. Like men, but of course, this is not the Batanian way. They sprung some woodland trickery up in the hills, killed off Naret's vanguard, and no doubt spent the rest of the battle whooping and boasting about and chopping the heads off the men who already died. Savages, man. It was the Sturgeons who met Naret's guards face to face. My father ordered me to stay back as he led me, led them into battle. But he was at their head. He forced them back. Then they broke and ran from the shelter of the camp. We went and attacked their ramparts and broke them. But my father was hit by an imperial mace at the moment of his triumph and died. Damn, dude. I will never forget the mess when the messenger ran to tell me that my father was dead. But I knew I must swallow my grief because now I was the king. You were. I rode down into the ruins of the imperial camp to take their banner as a trophy. My inheritance won my father passed down to me. Oh, some of the boyos were insubordinant. But I have since show them that I am master. If you want more information, there are two people you must try and speak to. Istinia worked as some sort of unofficial spy master for the Nerets. She lives classic. Where does she live? Then there is Arzagos, who was his bodyguard. He suppose he's supposed to be the Manorath Manorath. Though I hear he's changed quite a bit since then. Ugh. Thank goodness. We'll talk about that later. For the moment. You know, I need to meet her. I need to meet her. I need, still need to rebuild my clan. I've got some money going. I need to build my party size. My room there. Damn. That was quite a mission. Um, yeah. I think we're going to cut it there. That was quite a long journey. I had to... Uh, I'd probably cut all the, uh, the running scenes out, which I am going to do. Because they're just... I, we went all over this map. We were down here. Man, we went everywhere. So, which is good. We know the map a little bit. Getting around. We're meeting people. Um, so yeah, if you do like this, uh, episode two, we finally got the quest done. Uh, we're going to continue on with the quest. So we're going to build up our army. Um, so yeah, if you do like this, chuck a like. It helps out. Throw a subscribe. Up to you. 
would appreciate it though. And I'm going to come back with another episode and we're going to continue on with this quest. We're going to meet Istinia and we're going to meet Azaragos. And yeah, we'll go from there. So thanks for tuning in everyone. Um, and uh, I will see you again soon, hopefully. See you later. Bye.